And hello, folks. It is I, Kamikaze. I'm getting up and actually doing something, which in this case is another Super Nintendo game because my mouse is not going to arrive until, well, either tomorrow or Thursday, so I really can't stand using the trackball anymore, so I'm just not PC gaming at the moment. But this morning, I pretty much been in, <laughs> went to bed at like, you know, 2.30 a.m., woke up at about 4.30 a.m., and been sitting in bed all the way until now, which right now, at this moment, it's 3.08 p.m. So, almost 12 hours, I've been just sitting in bed, smacking myself all up and down my own face. Uh, as indicated before, I have a great skill of messing things up, making things worse, making things bad. With the greatest of good intentions, I make things worse. But, uh, without further to do... Wait, where the hell did that go? There it is. Need to find my Super Pretendo controller. We're going to play... Super Nintendo. Haven't played this game in forever either. This actually was one of the first games I was trying to put on my channel. And, well... I just... I, I, it was so bad. <laughs> Probably still has the same save file, too. And so, it's Super Mario RPG, Legend of the Seven Stars, uh, another one of my ultimate favorite games. And yes, I still have ultimate favorites of the Super Nintendo. I was 11 when this came out. Um, essentially, she's going to kick my ass if I don't keep doing something. Now look, look, that's, that's what I was doing before. Apparently I made it to the sunken ship, yet I think I only uploaded one video. Maybe I just continued afterward. I don't remember. I don't even know if it's still on my channel. But we're gonna start square from one. Square from one. Oh, maybe I should select new game instead. <sighs> How many letters do I get? Hey, right, cool. I think that will work. Okay. So it looks like it just comes out of an outhouse in the beginning of this game. I actually thought that was the case. I also thought the game was much shorter than it actually is. But Super Mario RPG, essentially the beginning of the Paper Mario series, which they never, after uh, I think Thousand Year Door, made it like it was before. I've played like all the Paper Marios and they just can't capture what this was ever again. Heck, they should make a remake of it. So, it's actually, everything is two dimensions. There's not a single three-dimensional thing in this game. Um, despite the fake appearance of it. Don't need to fight any of these guys. Wow, can I not run? And there's time hits, which still exist to this day. So that was a, a good defense, an okay defense, and I miss. 
which, depending on your timing, does actually make a difference in this game. Unfortunately, the chances of dying in the beginning, I, I think I've never actually tried to die in the beginning. It's tempting to just try, that's going to take way too long and I'm lazy. <sighs> but yeah. I'm just simply playing a waiting game at this point, because I'm not going to irritate, bother, pester, even though I want to at every freaking moment. Uh, so let's go save the princess, shall we? Oh, Belle. Oh, wait, wrong story. Peach! That would make Mario the Beast. Or it'd make him Gaston. Don't let Bowser bruise you, Mario. Mario, prepare yourself for the great beyond. I can't do a Bowser voice. Screw that. Um, so if you've ever never played this game, it actually, in this part, gives you two things. You can attack Bowser all you want. He has unlimited health, but... Oh, he missed. Good. Two good jumps should actually just end this little thing right here. See, that was a bad one. Even though it still made that sound, I only did 35 damage instead of... <laughs> what was that sound? Oh no! It's a chain reaction. Hang on, Link Link. And it seemed like we were only like, you know, 20 feet off the ground, but apparently we're much higher. And so now, imagine how far he is down there right now. Just imagine. And then... Coming, Mario. What an arm. Fight, Mario, fight! This should finish you. Apparently, we fall really slowly. Waha, did you think I was just going to give her to ya? You're always in my way. This is it. I'm going to take you out, Mario. Funga, foiled again. Oh, Mario, you had me so worried. Let's get out of here. What is he holding? Was he like holding onto the chain with it? Well, right now, is he clenching his butt cheeks to hold onto the chain? Um, but what was he holding onto before when he was reaching out to her? Into space. When my friend first introduced this to me, which a funny thing is, is he had the same birthday as I did, I thought this was the end of the game right here. I don't know why. Probably because I was, what, 11? And stupid? Because I thought this said, The End. Which obviously it doesn't. Another stupid thing was, is the first time I was introduced to this game, at the point he showed me this, he decided that he was going to show me the final boss. Which I'm not going to mention who the final boss is or anything, because mm -hmm. you may not have played this game. You may not have seen this game, and I'm not going to take the risk of that. But... He couldn't beat it. He said he was trying for weeks to beat this guy. And so he said, here you go. Have fun. And the stupid thing was, is I won. I used all the items that I had no idea how they worked. And actually won it on my first try. So I beat the end of the game before playing the rest of the game. Which actually, in hindsight, it did not make it any worse. I, this game is fantastic. Hey, Mario. Lots of people use something called a door to go in and out of their houses. Anyway, I came to pick up Toadstool since she is a bit light. And I believe he talked to the empty uh, clothes on the rack, which is just overalls and a hat, but where's his shirt? And this game is just great because there's so many things you can interact with, like good night in the middle of the day. And you can just sit in bed, and wait, and plan and plot, and wonder how big your snot bubble was while you were sleeping, and then boom. Oh, then if I try and leave before jumping on this box, he's gonna yell at me, and I don't really want to deal with that. It's a safe box. And 
we're gonna, you know what? Screw that one. That one is now dead to me. And if you want to just, you know, hang out. You can jump on almost any moving object and we'll move with you. Oh, crap, I forgot. I have to talk to him anyway. Freaking stupid monkey poop. Okay. Hey, I thought Princess was with you, Mario! Where is she? Mario, what's with the silent treatment? You're not telling me something. It's Bowser again, isn't it? Oh, I can't do this. Oh no, here we go again. Mario, would you please bring her back like you always do? Never. There's too many characters that I, I can't do voices for. Probably the only one I could do voice for is Mario. But then again, he actually doesn't talk in here, so that makes no difference anyway. Halt, who goes there? Our trespasses sir. This castle belongs to us, the Smithy Gang. It's our first step toward taking over this world. And if you weren't for you nosy characters like you, we'd practically own this world. So let's see you deal with this. We think that would take down the structural integrity of the castle itself, as well as the bridge. And we go back and talk to little Toad. Wait, where'd he go? Oh wait, I remember. Oh, I forgot about bouncing beds. It's a lovely wall. You're back so soon? Did you forget something? No. What happened then? And Mario's form of communication before he had a voice in the Nintendo 64. We must inform the Chancellor of Mushroom Kingdom at once. Let's go, Mario. I should learn to read. Out loud. Oh, and... I have 20 out of 20 HP. Oops, excuse me. Oh, that bump on your head reduced your HP level. One of Mushroom Kingdom's famous items ought to perk you up right up. Received a mushroom. Do you know how to use the item? Of course I do. Oh, I see. Oh, you're just so well-traveled and experienced, Mario. I'm envious. Or jealous. I don't remember which one means what. Ah, uh, now, why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. Ah, okay, I remember. I came to warn you that Mushroom Way is swarming with monsters. I just barely made it here in one piece. Mario, please do something. Perhaps I can help. Do you know about time hits? Is that the, the intervals between taking hot hits? And yes, I do. Hey, you better watch out. He knows about timed hits. He's gonna punch your lights out. Welcome back to 96. He's got more bark than bite, huh? Now, when I rush back, I had something to tell you. Oh, that's right! We need to go tell the town show about Toadstool. I'll see you over the Mushroom Kingdom. Just in case, take these with you. They will help you on your way. Um, if you actually do the tutorial for that first mushroom, it actually uses the mushroom. So if you want to keep that as an item, you'd want to say that you know about them. Because look, I actually took one damage from Toad running into me. Now moving on. Time for Mushroom Way, which there's only one thing I really want to do while in here, which normally I like grinding, but I'm going to try and do this without the normal grind that exists. And there's an unlimited supply of guys in the way. Out of my way, you are in my way, get away. There we go. Gotta save Little Toad. And each uh, monster has its own strengths and weaknesses, which include, uh, like Goombas, they're weak to jumping on them, as well as uh, turtles are as well. Whew, my life was flashing before my eyes for a second there. Here's a little something in return. Receive the honey syrup. And that is essentially a mana pot in this game. Try and do 
do this as minimalist as possible. Get items, show cool, funny, stupid stuff in the game, but still beat it in the process. I'll do what I need to in order to uh, survive better, but I'm not going to <laughs> spend any really long periods of time grinding, because this is an RPG. And I want... Oops, wrong button. That one. The faster gets caught by everything. You know what? Uh, no, I'm gonna save that. Wait, do I wanna save that? Yeah, I wanna save that. Whoops! That was dumb. Boy, that was a close call. Here's a token of my appreciation. Flower tab. Which, uh, the thing about flower taps is they're great for two items. Or two reasons. Uh, one, if you use them, they increase your flowers, which is your flower power, your MP in this game. Um, the second thing is, is that every tab, like, oh, uh, there's tabs, jars, and boxes. Like, one, three, and five of how much you will increase. Each one counts for 100 coins, so this thing itself is worth 100 coins for me, so... I'm actually going to keep a hold of it for now, and then get the hell out of here, as well as... Oh, wait. I could have used that. Damn, I'm not smart. Those replenish your HP, MP, and all that great stuff. And here's where I normally would grind, my, grind it out, but get out of my way. But we're just going to take him out, or die trying, one of the two. Hey, are you looking at me? My hammer and I don't like you. Mario, you better be careful, he's definitely got a mean streak. I bet he does. I could leave, or I could come back. Now you got my hammer angry. You shouldn't have done that. And the best method for these guys, if you even care, is, well, not dying from this. Ow. That hurt a ridiculous amount. best thing to do is to jump on each of them once, because if one of them dies, they uh, beef up their defense. I'm not going to risk dying here. I've come too far to face you again. Ooh, and occasionally you will randomly get a freebie. There's no rhyme or reason as to why it gives you them. I've never figured that out. I level up until I, um, I'm pretty close to getting, uh, my spe next special skill after the jump. But I am... As I said, I told you what I'm doing. Thanks, Mario! I was running so fast I wasn't watching where I was going. Mushroom Kingdom's just ahead. We're almost there, Mario. Hey, where did this hammer come from? Hmm. Hey, do you know what this is? It has Hammer Bros insignia on it. No one stand a chance against you when, when blah, 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 chance against you when you want them with this. You never know. Might come in handy. Of course it will. Picked up a hammer. Let's get a move on. I'll see you in the mushroom kingdom. And uh, I believe, if I remember correctly, if you don't save Toad at those points, you don't run into him here, but you also don't get the goodies that I picked up. Uh, items? No, not items. We want... equipment. And yes, Mario likes using hammers, shells, other kinds of things as weapons. You'll see most of them later. I will also unlock the secret of the lazy stuff. Never talk to her. Ever. If you talk to her or try and run past her, she, I don't know, she just irritates me. You know what? I'm gonna show you. This, this is why. Mario, look what you're standing in! And you have to jump. Ha, gotcha. That's why I hate her. Whoa, can you walk straight? Oh, 
Uh, here is a point where if you miss this, you'll never be able to get this for the rest of your life. Unless you start over again. No! I missed it! Damn it! Ah! Up there, above the door, there's a frog coin. And if you miss it here, you can never get it again. Oh well, doesn't matter. Not like I've ever collected them all anyway. Sir, Mario has arrived. Try and walk behind things. Hey, 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 wrong way. Oh, I'm sorry. No, no! Damn it, there is another way around. <laughs> Thank goodness you're here. We heard an explosion or something at Bowser's Keep. It was so loud, I almost dropped my spores. Wait, isn't that how they reproduce? I never thought about that. Hmm. Excuse me. Where's the princess? She departed your house hours ago. I fear the worst. Could Bowser somehow be behind all of this? My favorite parts. Spores alive! You're telling us that Bowser's abducted the princess again? Never mind. It will be up to you to enter the keep and rescue Princess Toadstool. Keep is unassailable? What awful power is at work here? Mario, her life is in your hands. Please, save our dear princess. Oh, I remember. I'm gonna, like, try and walk. Uh, it's a very difficult process. Mario! I almost forgot. This may not help you, but why don't you take it along? Got a map. Mario! I am. Forgive me. But I can't stop worrying about the princess. Go to the cellar and prepare your, for your journey. The bald guard shall assist you. And there's only two times you can gather these goodies. One is while talking to him now. Mario! The Chancellor filled me in. Come, let me show you around. Help yourself to the treasures, and he'll explain everything, blah blah blah. <gasps> this is a coin. The small ones are worth one, and the large ones are worth ten. This one's a ten. <laughs> On a scale of one to ten, you're a nine, because I'm the only one you need. Uh, this is a flower. The more you gather, the more flower points you'll have in battle. And so you can get these instead of flower taps by, well, this way and it just increases your flowers. Find them. And that's what I mentioned before, which is the uh, mushroom over story. Hit points and flower points. Unfortunately, mushrooms you find as items only restore your HP. So beware. Goodbye. I think I still don't know how to run! Holy crap. Oh, 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 I know what we can do. There's two ways of doing this. I come over here into here. This is the princess's bedroom. If you come over into this area and search, I'm not actually going to push it because it'll say found toadstools, question mark, question mark, question mark. And then this elderly shroom will come and give you an item to leave everything the way it was. But if you don't, don't grab this. It'll make something entertaining later on when you do find the princess. Um, so I'm going to leave it there. And I really just don't want that mushroom. Walk around. Thank you. Come back here! Oh, I don't think that's the right voice, but it doesn't matter. Or it's like, come back here. No. Come back here. Don't run. Oh no, 
that reptile stole my grandpa's gun. Boo, <laughs> sniffle. I can't cry, big boys. They don't cry, I, I. It's just not fair. What am I gonna do? Okay, I'm done making his voice. Make sure he stays dry. Like, yes? Gee, you're soaking wet, aren't you? I'm alright now, sorry. There's nothing like a good cry. But, why was I crying? There was some reason. My grandpa asked me to buy some things for him here, and when I walked into town, that croc stopped me. Oh yeah! He took, they took it from me! He stole my coin! I chased him, but he's way too fast. Mario, let's see how you're going to take care of Bowser. Wow, he doesn't stand a chance. Wow, you're the Mario? I know all about you. You've got more jump in you than a box of frogs. I'm Malo from Tadpole Pond. I'm a frog. But can you believe it? I can't jump. Embarrassing, huh? How about it, Mario? Will you help me catch that filthy thief? Well, he didn't look too terribly dirty, but... Sure. Or, I'm a little busy. If I say I'm a little busy, people get mad at me and I think he starts crying again, but I'm not gonna do that. The young frog, Malo, who doesn't look at all like a frog, joins Mario in his quest. Um. Ah, one of my favorite lines ever is from this guy. Uh, I feel like I'm forgetting something. In this world, there are things called hidden treasures. Use your awesome jumping ability to look for them. I need you to walk over sideways, then I can get the item here. No! No, turn around. Turn, turn, turn around. No! I, yep, go that way. That way, no, not that way, not that way. Come on, obey me! I said obey me, you damn shroom. Okay, now that I got you there. No, 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 no. Keep going. Keep going. Yes! Boom! That's what I want. Or you can get this shopkeeper mad at you. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Get off there this minute! And then there's also this. Alright now, let's start again. Go in front of the counter and talk to me. And then he'll just... Yeah, why not? Storyline. Hey, Molo! What kept you? I was starting to worry! Wait until you hear this, you see. Wait, I've heard it already. Old Frog Fruish has told me. He seems to know everything. Hold on. Wait, listen! The truth of the matter is, well, the coin was stolen. What?! Well, if that's the case, I guess you can't trade. What a shame, huh? Oh, but there's no need to worry. Mario here will help us out. Zot so, well, if Mario's on your team, then you'll have that coin back in a jiffy. Yep. Not so fast. Take this with you. You'll probably need it. And that is a revive, so if someone dies in battle, you can use that. Now, to my favorite line. Mario! I have something to report, sir! I saw him! He's so he's here somewhere! He just zoomed past me a second ago! Did you see him? Did he look something like this? Well, why yes, exactly! He's the one who took my coin! Why didn't you stop him? Because I forgot my bazooka at home. Sheesh, give me a break here. Come back here. Horror horror. These mugs will never catch me. A snail could outrun you morons later. I love the use of sound effects in this game. It was just so much more useful than uh, any other game I've really heard. That's him. Hurry, Mario. Let's get him. Wait, what? Okay. Well, in this case, we're going to go safe. Just so we have a new save point. Because I have a bad habit of dying. <laughs> Still level 1. And I think the max level is like something like 20. I know, that sounds really weird, but yes. Um, but at this point, since we have now completed investigating the Mushroom Kingdom, and this brings you into the world of Super Mario RPG, 
I'm going to call it here. If you folks had fun, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, do all the fun things. I will see you guys in the next video, and hopefully I will gain more sanity when I hear more knowledge of the future.